Hello everyone, Max Knight here, playing Trazia. Uh, since we last left off, we have uh, gone and gotten everybody better equipment and power sticks. Power sticks are accessories, they increase your defense by 10, and whether it's a bug or a feature, you can equip as many of them as you want. Everyone's defense range is up at least 140, except for Floyd, he shouldn't be getting hit anyways. Now, on to business. Um, where we last left off, I was training, and we were going to go hunting in the woods up to the north. Step one, get to the woods up north. The uh, forest is actually kind of a maze. Uh, there's only one place to go, and that's to the uh, cave entrance behind it. And the fastest way to get there is definitely not battle. Not that I have a choice. Um, try to get through this as quickly as possible. Not that it actually goes by quickly. Uh, something to note is that Floyd is, in fact, the weakest at magic. This, but it's made up for by the fact that he has so much MP. He can cast so many times. Roy, on the other hand, has the strongest magic of all of us. But he has so little MP in comparison that he can barely cast two spells. In this case, those are founts. I suppose he could cast founts and howdas, but... That's because, together, they only cost 26 MP. Anyways, um, just a little announcement. I've changed from doing my recordings uh, in Camp Studio to Fraps. Just had to do a little upgrade of Fraps to a newer version, and I could uh, do my recordings in my emulators, either Kega or Gens. Unfortunately, I have to use Gens reason being is because Kega, when using the lower resolution, the, the lower video mode, you might have seen it in the videos uh, of Shining Force 2, they look all kind of blurry, and sometimes you can't quite see the, uh, you can't quite see the, uh, the lettering, the numbers and whatnot very clearly. Some They don't look very clear, that's why you'd see me sometimes going into the actual menu screen of a character for a second. It's because I couldn't see what the number was. But anyways, we're, we're past that now. There's one huge downside to gens, and you can hear it in the music. Basically, uh, I really, really hate the music in this game. Er, er, I should say, I hate the music in this emulator. Because it's kind of distorted. And that's not a good thing. I mean, you can hear this, like, very audible, kind of a... I'm trying to think of how to describe the sound too well. Um, it's just a sound that doesn't belong there. You can hear it in comparison to my other last two videos. Um, shoot. I kind of forgot what time I started this on. Well, how about this? Um, just follow the directions I give you on here, you know, watch, watching where I'm going, if, if you're playing along at some point. And I will cut off the recording once we get into the cave, because there is a cave. And you have to follow some crazy looking uh, directions to get to it. I mean, sometimes you look like you're going to be going back around on yourself. And stupid battles. Ravens. Ravens are... They're weak is the problem. No, I don't want magic. I want to defend. There's really not a lot to say, you know, when you're just kind of getting through the battle or whatever. And it's not that it... I mean, I, I, there was a remark uh, by a friend of mine on a forum that the game looks kind of boring, you know, and it, and in, in a way it kind of is. Half the point of the game is to, uh, is to laugh at the mistranslations of basically everything. And to, uh, and to just kind of bask in the ambiance of a game that, for all intents and purposes, probably shouldn't have existed. I mean, not that there's a lot you can do about it, but...
Apparently these are forest snakes. Maybe they're stronger than snakes, I don't know. I could have sworn the last time I came through here, in one of my failed attempts at this video, uh, didn't actually have forest snakes in the forest. Alright. Here's the cave. There's different music. And I'm going to leave off here. And join me next time where I will explore the cave and maybe pay attention to what time I started this. And uh, I'll see ya.